children, welcome back to Very Perfect Skill and we are going to have fun with balance scales today. For this experiment, we need a large popsicle stick, a pipe cleaner, a small bead, four disc magnets, clothespin, paper clips, one rubber band, and few paper clips and some weights. So now let's start the experiment. We are going to put in the rubber band exactly at the center. And insert the bead inside the pipe cleaner. Make sure the bead is also in the center. And with the help of the paper clips, we will place the pipe cleaner on the popsicle stick like this. Now make sure the bead and the rubber band fall in the center of the popsicle stick. Now we are going to suspend this balance scale with the paper uh, cloth pin. See whether it is balanced. Now we are going to place these magnetic discs on both sides of the paper clips. Check again whether it, the scale is balanced. Yes. Now let's add the weights. Are you able to notice this part of the scale is heavy. Our DIY balance scale is ready and we are able to weigh Let's learn about mass and weight before we start learning about the balancing scale. What is mass? Mass is the amount of any matter, amount of matter in any object. Mass is the amount of matter in any, any of this object. Mass is commonly measured by how much something weighs. Mass is measured in terms of grams, kilograms, tons, pounds, etc. Now, what is weight? 
Weight is a measurement of how much the force of gravity acts on a given amount of mass. If you have an object and take it to any other country, it weighs, it, its weight varies, but mass stays the same. So, so if you take any, any object to the moon, the weight may be lesser than it has on earth. So, mass and weight are usually measured in terms of the SI units. Mass is usually measured in kilograms, grams, tons, pounds, etc. And weight in terms of Newton. So, how do you weigh the objects? We use weighing scales. Scales measure how much the object weighs. They do it by measuring how much force is exerted on the object we are weighing and the earth. There is the force between earth and the weighing object. So, we measure it with the weighing scale. And the measuring shows how much force is exerted on the object we are weighing. So we have made our own weighing scale with the simple materials we have at home. Please do this experiment and find out how much, it, how much any object weighs at home. Thank you children.